Hi, welcome back to Cannabis with Kim. I'm Kim. I just wanted to show you guys a few little fun things that I've gotten through the Ardent. Um, so what I'm doing right now is I am decarbing some flour. I am doing some Rollins. So there's this new thing that Arden came out with, which is the, it's a new sleeve. It's a silicone sleeve for the Arden FX. So it's larger and it's got these little hole handles. Thank God. So I put some, I put, I ground down some Sativa Cresco Rollins flour. And so all I did was I put it in a glass jar. You can put it straight in here. You can put it straight in here. I just like using jars, glass jars, guys, because it's just easier for me to transfer stuff. So look at this what goes right in so i was already starting to decarb i just started and i decided to do this video real quick so this is what i'm using wait is this one rollins no this one is so j hayes um low low percentage on this one but what am i doing with the oil so what i'm going to do is i'm going to you know decarb it and then let me show you because this is the next step here is some that i already decarbed Oh no, wait, forgive me. This is my SoJ. <laughs> I've been decarbing a lot, guys. So this is my SoJ Haze that I already had decarbed. It's a sativa. This is Cresco, like I was saying. And what I did was I put some extra, um, I shouldn't say extra, uh, organic avocado oil. And it's pure extra virgin, unrefined, cold pressed. Okay. So all of those things are important because it is less processed and you get more of the benefits and it also pulls more of the cannabinoids out look at my pal look at we got all kinds of good stuff to cook up anyway er, back to here so what did i do first i am decarbing the flour like there and then i put my avocado oil in on top of the flour that is already decarbed mixed it up and then of course i put it into my ball jar these are the little ball jars, the four ounce ones. Okay. And so I'm going to take this now and I go ahead and remember just this tube. So this is my other, I know I have a team of Ardens. Do you like this? So now that one goes in, Let me move this one out of the way. Um, okay. And notice he's not plugged in. So we got to find him a plug. See, ah, on. Well, first of course, so what do I have in here? I've got decarbed flour with the organic avocado oil mixed in with the decarbed flour in a four ounce ball jar slipped into the ardent sleeve. Totally do not need to use the sleeve. Remember I was using tongs to pull it out of there. It works just as well. Okay, but the sleeve is kind of cool. So now remember, what am I doing now? Well, I'm infusing, right? So we are, notice the first A1 is on here because what's going on here? Decarboxylation. Now we go here and we are already decarbed and A2, remember, is for CBD. I made that mistake before. So I'm going to press my little M. That's A2. Press it again. Infuse is lit up now. Okay, so now I'm going to press my start button. So now I'm just going to sit back and wait for these two to finish. So here's another little toy that I wanted to show you. What am I going to do, first of all, with the avocado oil? I'm making party crackers for New Year's Eve. So, yeah, you take these saltines, you put them in a bag with this. This is the best. Can I just tell you? I get this in Door County, and I go to the store. When I go there, I... I came to, I buy like six of these, but look here, in case you want to try this, savoryfinefoods.com. Now they say add canola oil. You know, I'm not going to follow the directions because what I do is I'm going to make one half of it dosed and one half of it for other people. <laughs> so I'll have a dosed side and I'll have a non-dosed side. So that's why I've got two bags here. So I'm going to put two sleeves of this with half the powder and two sleeves of this and the other one with half the powder. And then I'm going to use half dosed and half non-dosed. Now check this out. This came from Ardent and they're doing all these little, and look at, I haven't tried my dosed stuffing yet, but they sent Tuscan herb. I'm also getting the all the new toys that are coming out. So I'll keep 
showing you videos of the new Arden stuff. So I'm going to attempt this stuffing. They did a cornbread stuffing, a traditional stuffing, a cranberry stuffing, and then they have like some gravies. So I'm going to infuse these and see how that turns out. I'll give you guys a video on that. The other thing that they have is, of course, the magic shell, and they have these infusion kits, but I'm not going to lie to you guys. You can do this on your own. So, infusion press. But this is something that's new. So, let's say you want to just use one of these tubes. I think I've got all of them filled. All right. So, let's say we threw our, our flour in there and we decarbed it. Then we could just chug our oil in there, glug, 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 infuse it the way I'm doing it here. I don't have to use a jar. I don't have to use anything. I can just use the tube. But how do you get that out of there? Well, what did Arden come up with? An infusion press. And it's like a French press, guys, if you've ever seen a French press. So here is your mesh, of course, strainer. So yeah, you just shove this down in the tube. Let me see, do I have an empty one? I do have an empty one, this one. So let's say you have flour and oil just dumped in there. Well, now you would take this and you would put it in here and you push it, push it all the way down. And what that does is, of course, let me lift it up. Uh, uh, uh. What that does is it forces the strainer all the way to the bottom, which pushes all the flour to the bottom. And the strainer, of course, is going to keep any of the flour. Uh, it's going to separate it from your oil. And so then now, just pop that top on. You got your nice little hole right here. And, of course, remember this comes off the base. So then now you can just pour it out. Boop, 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 boop. And your flour stays inside of here. And the oil comes out completely strained, so you don't have to worry about that. So that's kind of cool. New toy, new toy. Had to get it. Had to check it out. Um, so yeah, there's there's where we're at. We've got the new um, infusion sleeves for the FX. And we have the infusion press for the Arden FX. I got the... Well, it doesn't say it on the outside, but this is the stuffing infusion kit and I should be getting the apple pie and the truffle and I'm also going to be doing infused bath bombs so that's all coming up so this is today's day with ardent